Alright. I think if we go upstairs, it'll be fine. I think, I think it'll be too. Hi, everyone, welcome back to Divinity. That's fine. <laughs> they don't care. I mean. Uh, let's go look at Gratilda's, uh. Fucking. Oh, wait, we were there already. We were. That's where we came from. You, you, know that, you know that place that we fucking found? The. I put my teleporter pyramid through it? Yeah. Oh. That's, where, that's what she was referring to. So, literally useless. Let me look at the orc cavern. Was there any evidence in, inside her inside her little thing that she took out of me? Maybe? I don't know. I don't think there was anything there. Go looking around, maybe. The rat palace. Nah, okay, let me let me have a look at our quest log then. So we have War of the Stones. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna talk to Gratilda, but I don't know. What happens if Medora's in the party? You know what? Can I can I take Medora from you? Sure, go nuts. Where, where, where are you right now? Just outside the tavern. Oh, there you are. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna just take I'm gonna take her from you. If it starts combat, I'm gonna fucking not not do anything with it. So, I just want to see what's gonna happen if Gratilda sees her. Yeah, that's out of curiosity. Hey, Gratilda. Brave of you to disturb me, human. In your experience, has bravery been a particularly effective defense against disembowelment? But Medora doesn't seem to really care. All right, you're leader of the orcs, are you not? Leader, a word that hardly suffices. I lead them as far as the head leads the body. They serve me and live in service to me. I am their all-mother. The beginning and end of their very lives. I am loved by them. I am craved by them. I choose from among them he who pleases me, and I destroy the rest. The orcs of this tribe are executors of my will. No more. I understand you get first pick of the Swell's War. Naturally. There are few finer pleasures than standing before the fruits of one's labor. A stack of gold and goods to one side and sopping sinews and bone to the other. Ah, oh, divine. I've developed a particular affinity for Tenebrium of late. The sheen of it rather pleases the eye. My boys know not to keep a shard of the stuff from me. Consider this your warning, too. And what use uh, have the orcs for this miserable town? Miserable, you say? I quite like it. Save the altogether hideous pink apes infesting the place. But exterminating them was a rather titillating diversion, I must admit. The townsfolk here were no different from those in the north. The larger ones beg me to spare the smaller ones. The smaller ones bleat like lambs for the larger ones. Yet they each squeal just the same when you split their piggy skin from nose to navel. Yes, I dare say the wizard won't be so pleased with himself for evading us when he returns. His servants' entrails will be wreathed among his grapevines, and the rest of the villagers are already hacking away in the Tenebrium mines. Undead drones, bent in service to the conduit. Who is this wizard you speak? Our conduit didn't describe every detail of her plan to her mold-eyed pets in the mines. Well, no matter. It hardly concerns you, unless you can break the enchantments protecting his house. But that's a matter of magic, not the erotic virtues of your mother's rot-rancid corpse. I doubt anyone from Silver Glen will be of use. The, w the wizard's house is protected by powerful magic, it seems. So it seems. But even the cleverest magician cannot conceal his tricks forever. The wizard may have fled, but he left a passel of servants behind. Servants I very much doubt will be immune to the charms of my screws and cleavers. Let's discuss your orcs. Uh, let's discuss the rat catcher. My patience for his antics is wearing thin. Madness I can tolerate, but failure. 
Not for a moment. Uh, haven't you heard? He's lost control over the rats and makes no progress towards finding villagers. So, our rat catcher has overstayed his usefulness. How I do enjoy a problem with an exceedingly simple solution. Pardon? Oh, uh, he likes us a lot more now. He likes she likes Medora more now. <laughs> nice. I think I think she's gonna kill the rat catcher. Can I borrow your uh, teleporter pyramid, please? Uh, sure. Where are you at? I'm just gonna get back to that cellar. I'm gonna explore it. Okay. There you go. I, I, I didn't even meet the rat catcher, but she's. I think she's gonna go kill him now. Oh, here's the rat catcher. Oh, he's so fucked, dude. Enjoying your time. Milling about senselessly, like one of your vermin. Nice and sexy, and work. Only the rest of the time is nearly nigh. You eat the Ah, she just killed the rat catcher. Rip and piss. Did he deserve it? I mean, I I don't know why she trusted me. <laughs> I'll be honest. All right. She's an orc. Oh, I'll save it again. Are you are you good now? I'm just blowing things up down here. So I'm just I'm looking for any evidence of the bloodstones. When I can find any. Oh, you sold like everything to this guy. Holy shit. I'm warm. It's fresh apple pie. What are you doing? You can have Adora back, by the way. She did not react to Adora being in the party at all. And neither did Medora, so I don't fucking know what's going on. Alright, so you're the executioner here. I never did much care for the turn myself. I'm more of a caretaker, you see. The world's a wild place, unpredictable at best. But here, upon these gallows, there's peace, calm. I keep the order, and my little ones stay in line. By little ones, do you mean the condemned? Condemned in this life, perhaps. But when they come to rest in my music, their sins are washed away. These aren't thieves and murderers and traitors, you see. After I've laid them to rest here, they're pure as angels. My little angel. Okay, do you perform all these executions yourself? Most of them, yes. But that's far from my only order of business. Our great Queen Gretilda is no stranger in her claws, bloody. And she'll not hesitate to pluck out a pair of eyes what looked at her sideways. I handle all the dreaming dears when she's done with them all the same. Whether they're my little ones or hers makes no difference. I'm happy to bring them here. To rest among me and mine. Uh, tell me more about these men and orcs. It should be an order. Where are we to start? Uh, about the men on the far left. Pauling came first, the little rogue. A human he was, and Gatilda ordered him hanged while Yarl was out on the hunt. He was the first I got to tuck in myself since coming to this town. Oh, I remember it like it was yesterday. The fussy little dear didn't want to go to sleep. No, no. Kicked and screamed, he did. But he started to calm down a bit after I strayed him up as I knew he would. And soon he was fast asleep. 
Uh, tell me what's the second mantle, uh, second on the left. Oh, my little Tierlo. He was a sweet one right from the start. A thief, I think he was in his last life. But he accepted what was to come easy as pie. The guards handed him to me, limp as a doll and shivering with fright. I strung him up nice and slow, so as not to worry the poor dear. <laughs> nice and slow. Tell me about the orc there, the third from the left. He was one of Gratilda's. Asked her some impertinent question or other, I believe it was. Impertinent questions. A plague among we orcs they are. Any more deaths than horn rot these days. Well, Gratilda dispatched him. But it was I who collected the great heavy deer and strung him up here. Gratilda said he'd be a warning to the others. But I think he's a great addition to the family, to boot. He does look a lovely sort of pale green colour, don't he? Like a dusty ancient jade. Beautiful. Uh, tell me about the rat catcher. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I tried to bring the deer into the fold, but he won't have any of it. Strange what he is. The second life didn't change him none. Alright, well, that's it for this guy. It doesn't take much to send Gratilda over Trouble to be for a party. And she doesn't seem to discriminate between ally and enemy. Look, there. Again, the lost one struts by. Sorry, what are you doing? It's party time. What do you mean it's party time? They're in the roof of the tavern. You're in the tavern? I, I don't have a teleporter pyramid. Do you, you have mine? No, I give it back to you. Oh, did you? Oh. It just doesn't auto go back to the hot bar. I know. Where the fuck are you right this now? There's an orc up here. Does he have a good time? Fuck. Poor little toys. Poor quiet one. Two. <laughs> I told you, man, he's having a good time. Dude, that looks fun as fuck. New toys! New toys! But, where's Mum? What's, what's she want me to do with you? Something's wrong. This is the monster who killed all those villages? This. This child? Which are perhaps you should talk to Norok. You want me to, but this can't be right. The orc I remember, he was, he was evil, a sadistic monster. This is, oh my head is spinning faster than a broken bumblebee. Let me, let me get a good look at him. Hello, I remember you. We used to be friends, didn't we? Yeah, we were great friends. We played all the live long night, and I made pretty red ribbons up and down, and down and up your face. Where'd your ribbons go? Do you want I should give you some more? This isn't right. I'm gonna be sick. I could trade with Medora. <laughs> no, that's Norak, actually. It's all right, Medora. We're here together. No harm will come to you. Why am I waiting for other player? I don't know. I'm not in this dialogue and I can't. Why Why are you not in this dialogue? I don't know. I've been trying to get in it and I can't. Uh, dude, this what is... What can I, I do for you? I, I'm stuck. Good. No use. I'm, I'm actually stuck. I can't do anything. Right, let, me, let me run around for a bit. I have an idea. <laughs> if I leave the area... <laughs> Surprise! No, it's just it's just stuck. Hmm. I might load it. Like I think I saved before coming up here. I did. Uh, touch a door or something. What happens if you press a door or something, or a dead door? Oh, oh, oh. There you go. Uh. oh please, please don't shout. Oh, Mum will be awfully cross if I make a ruckus. What do you mean by Mum? Mum! Oh, the best Mum in the whole wide world. Usually, orcs like me, scramble-headed, me brothers call me, are killed right away. But Mum says she took one look at me and knew I'd be the best warrior in the world. 
she brings me lots of toys and friends, and she showed me all the best games to play. At first, I, I didn't like how the toys would holler and cry when I'd make ribbons on them or play eyeball pop. But Mum taught me that that's how they show they're happy. First, they scream for joy. And then they take a long, long nap. Grutilda. Yeah, that's my mum's name. <gasps> Did you meet her? Do she want us to play together? I'll take my leave. Comrades, my mind's racing and my heart's gone like a snare drum. To be here, face to face with my greatest enemy and to find that he's... He's not at all like the villain I'd worked up in my mind. It's... it's unimaginable. I've hated him with every drop of blood in these veins. Hated him till my entire being screamed for revenge. But now I find he's as simple as a child. Maybe he even thought all the cruelty, the death he inflicted was... a game. And all around us, more victims, and years stretching behind us, and years stretching ahead of us, more dead bodies tortured and wrung by his hands. But you, comrade, time and again you show me the valor inherent of forgiveness. You face the impossibly cruel or weak, and you offer them a second chance. Still, I... I cannot forgive this monster. He may well be confused, and he may have been mistaught, but that won't stop him from killing again. Ho, oh, comrade, in the name of the Order of the Sauce Hunters, I ask you to lay down forgiveness and to join me now. To arms! Uh, uh, are you mad at me? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Whatever it was, I'm not doing it again. Okay, I think Vidora's mate promise. forcing us to do a fight, so just... Uh, I, I don't know if you want to buff and shit. Yeah, I'm gonna pull back so I'm not gonna buff the... Yeah, there we go. But I can't buff on Vidora, this is all I can do. The luck one. Alright, go ahead. Blessed talisman protect me. Fuck. <laughs> Good thing I buffed the fucking hell. Oh god. Ah, oh, fuck it, he's oh. stunned. Yeah, I'm stunned. So I That's guess you this, got, is, this is Bedora's fight, I guess. Let's see what hey, damage boost me. Yeah, that's a good idea, actually. I find you in solemn <laughs> I don't know if lowering resistance is going to do anything with this guy. Uh, his... You do piercing damage, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's pretty okay with that. Shocking touch. No, it's fucking his turn. Alright, so let's, uh... Sec. I have shit to do. <laughs> can make you the very best. I appreciate it. Because I'm just going to kill this guy. And if you don't... The Medora's out to clean up. Uh, let's do shock touch again. You can stun on that would be great. There you there go. go. Look at that. This transfer is a stunned from 43. Not that high. Wikataki, go fuck yourself. Time. Let's see, I have enough action points to do this. So you know what I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna lead with a silver arrow. That's a pretty good idea. <laughs> you fucking saber tip. Ah, it's you even recovered the arrow. How many fucking silver arrows do you have? Do you have like two stacks of that shit? Yes. <laughs> I should stop making and them. And it's not going yeah, you should stop making them. <laughs> and just, the yeah, 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 oh yeah. Dead boss. Been, Careful, comrade. 
I think I sense a sorcerer in yonder shadows. Okay. That, that's it. Uh, the, the dread orc is dead. Are you satisfied? Well, comrade, I'm a source hunter. Born, bred, and trained. And that there was a soul bent on committing evil deeds. I know full well he wasn't 100% accountable for his crimes, but I couldn't have stood to leave him living knowing there'd be a next victim. I'm no fool, comrade. I know it wasn't an easy case, not nearly so easy as I dreamed it to be. But I believe we've done right here today. Why leave? All right, this makes no sense to me, by the way. I don't even know. Like, she's like, randomly during the dialogue, she's like, oh, you've taught me to be nice and, and kind to everyone, but we're going to kill him anyways. Well, they're just saying, like, hey, I know that you guys have been really nice to general people, but fuck this guy. But, like, that makes no sense. Because I, I'm pretty sure that she's doing it based upon our actions in the game, but... Well, I think that's just the reasoning of, like, yeah, she's grown to forgive people, but this guy, fuck him. Fair enough. I think, I don't know, he's, he's a fucking kid. I don't think we could teach him to not kill. Also, like... We, we've we've done a lot of fuck ups here. <laughs> like we've we've fucking done a lot of shit well, here. There was the one time we killed all the immaculates. Like like how have they not figured out that there's something fishy going on here? <laughs> this is retarded. All right, let's see what do we have now. Our secret seller still. Ah, I'll go talk to Gratilda. So I, I was wondering. I'm like, I'm like, is is the door gonna say anything at any point? I thought she was mad at Gratilda, not fucking. By the way, you can you can take all the paintings. Brave of you to disturb me. I already am. In your experience, has bravery been a particularly effective defense against disembowelment? Let's discuss the wizard's missing servants. But how very obvious. Who better than a cow to bring a frightened calf back into the herd? Surely you and that bootlicker what? sensibility of yours ought to have an insight or two into where a servant might seek sanctuary. Our rat catcher, <laughs> regrettably, seems to be in need of some direction in the matter. I can't. Gratilda, the orc a leader that killed the rat catcher, is telling me I should talk to the rat catcher to help him find the villagers. <laughs> Man... Why are we sequence breaking this game so hard? It's not sequence breaking. We just did it in a different manner. And when I talk to the characters about it, they're like, they're unaware of their own actions. Like, we haven't, I'll be honest, we haven't seen this a lot. We, we haven't. It's only happened a couple of times. And when we see it, we notice it. Because uh, it's like, it's like the fuck happened here kind of thing. We kind of had to point it out. Otherwise, it's like, like, the Goodbye. I can, given the complexity of the quests in this game, I can forgive it. Like, there's been uh, very few instances of of it fucking up like that. So. Oh, and you immaculate face in town. What a pleasure to serve you. I've a deal running now. A double the whiskey for any and all who refrain from beating me from the neck up and the crotch down. Uh, so you're the purveyor of whiskey, are you? That I am. But I'll tell you, I never served a lot quite like these Goliaths. They drink like elephants and pay like... Well, they don't pay at all. Then again, I can't say I mind this little arrangement too terribly. The happier they are, the longer I evade the rack and the scroll. Each glass brings us closer to the last of the whiskey, though. My bowels shrink when I think what'll happen when we get to the bottom of the last barrel. We've already exhausted the tavern supply, but I've been pilfering from my old buddy Glen Stores. I doubt he'll mind, seeing as he was one of the first orcs sunk their claws into. Now that was a man dedicated to fine liquor. <laughs> Knew all there was to know about distilling whiskey, he did. Oh. Oh, what I'd give for a barrel of Glenn's good stuff now. <laughs> These orcs wouldn't know what hit them. Uh, talk about yourself. Oh, I'm nobody at all. Just the old tavern keeper in this here village. Things have been uh, <clears throat> busy since the orcs came, but I, uh, I've never been one to complain too much. Or especially with, uh, <clears throat> with my wife and kids gone. I prefer to keep my eye on the prize. 
Oh, whiskey, of course. No excruciatingly terrible memory, a nice glass of the good stuff can't wash away. <laughs> what do you know about these orcs? Oh, swell guys. Swollen as swell can be. I haven't a complaint in the world. Not in the wide world. Keep me busy, they do. Day and night. Night and day and day and night again. Oh, you might imagine me a wee bit utterly exhausted, but I wouldn't have it any other way. After all, the soul-crushing night terrors can't find you if you never sleep. <laughs> That's my motto. What do you know about this village? Well, the scenery's certainly changed in recent weeks, I'll tell you that much. Used to be a quiet sort of place. Family folks, you know. Never had much trouble, and all the less because our little town played host to a sauce hunter and a powerful wizard both. Can't say why we were uh, <clears throat> overcome so quickly. Uh, can't say why so many of us were cut down over those shiny stones. An immaculate like you know better than me, I suppose. Yes, I suppose an immaculate just like you might have been the one who held my son's head back while Gratilda sliced his throat open, eh? Oh, but who's got time to think on the past? That way lies danger, I say. I only know that these orcs are a thirsty lot. It's my job to keep my head down and the whiskey flowing. Take my leave. You know what, I'm gonna take the door from you. Just cause I, I, I keep talking to characters and I keep thinking to myself, would they say something different if Midora was beside me? So if you need her, just you let me know. What can I do you for? I'm gonna just go through the same thing that he just oh, said here. Oh, special. Oh, oh, you might imagine. Well, I'm just saying if he says anything oh, different. Oh, but who's got time to think of that? For a whiskey. Um, each glass now. No, he doesn't say anything different. <clears throat> I just, I, I want her to be with me. Cause I, I'm sure someone will recognize her at some point. All right. Well, let's. I guess. Uh. Well, so the guy that was guarding uh, the bullshit disappeared. We have the we have the way to open the source temple now, though. Uh, this just leads to outside. You know, what, I'm gonna go talk to the guys at the at uh, at the house. Actually, you know what? No, 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 actually, you know what? The crime scene. Definitely the crime scene. I guess we haven't touched that all, have we? Nope. Horrid and Charla's treading post. Is there anyone here? No. There's a bottle of swirling mud. I think this actually... I think I know what this does. I think you combine that with... Uh, I think I have the other component of it. Where is it? I forget. I, I, for, I forgot what it did. For the joint. I think I read something a, a, a little while back about it. We have um. Let me sort by type. Holy shit! I have a fucking huge health potion. Okay, we'll give that. I'm gonna give that to you, Kent, because <laughs> you need it. Because I'm already here for incumbent. Yes. Exactly. I appreciate it. It's the least I can do. Alright, so there's some kits here. Where's the other thing? Black fabric dye. Holy shit. I got some. When did I get the black fabric dye? Did I get that uh, from combining the other thing? I, it might, I must have. Where's the item I got here? Fiery heart. I think it's the fiery heart and uh, the other guy. Wait, just search, search, search by the latest added. Uh, actually, that's a, that's a good point. Yeah, he doesn't have it. Oh no, here it is. Bottle of swirling mud. I'm okay. a smart. And I think you combine it with the fiery heart. I think that's what you're supposed to do. What the fuck? Sword of planets? Yeah. You know what? I wish I had my crafting skill up. I think I think it's based on my crafting skill, perhaps. What when, when, was my last save? I didn't know it would make that. Yeah, okay. Uh, you haven't done so much in like the last couple minutes, have you? It's when I let a lot of tedious looting. Fuck. I I'll do know. it again though. You know, what, I'm gonna save it, and if it's no better than this, then I'll I'll go back to the other save then. Uh, I think it, it looks about the same. I'll just load it back to the other load. All right. I'll give you the sword. It's actually a pretty decent sword, actually. I don't know, it, maybe not for damage, but. <laughs> Why'd you give it to me? Why not give it to you? 
There was a quest here though I, I had here. Oh yeah, sword's not good. Those the skeleton traders we met. Charla in Sicil and Horton just outside this village. If this is to be believed, their spirits are trapped in a dark priestess's totem. Oh, is that what it, is that what it was about? Cordelia. Where's the totem though? Might oh, be in the basement. Is there a basement here? Yeah. Where? Over here. Oh, okay. You want the sword, though? The sword's pretty nice, isn't it? Holy shit! What have you done? The sword of planets? It's terrible. D what do you mean? The sword of planets, it gives you resist. Do you know how much damage I'm trading for that? It's not worth. Alright, how are we gonna deal with this? I was thinking of doing Avatar Fire, but I don't have a scroll for that. It's moments like this I wish I had never That forgot. did 26 damage to you? What did? You were hit by a fireball and just 26 damage. Oh, I ran into it? Oh. What I, are you afraid of? I guess we'll I'm not afraid there. anymore! <laughs> I'm not afraid anymore! <laughs> Alright. Boop! The fuck is going on here? Demons. Oh, dude, bottle of swirling mud again. Demons. Beard, what a find. I don't know what else it's for. All I know is I can make the sword of planets. Okay. I can tell you, it's not great. Well, I you're not great. Well, antique silver ring. I'm taking that. That was, a, that was an excellent book. In fact, come over. I'm just gonna keep you lucky, so we can. Just, yeah. You know what? You know, you know, you know. I don't know why I'm not doing this, but like, I have these empty skill books. I could just fucking make them into something, can't I? With the ink and quill. Oops. Yeah, you can make them into skill books. Just random ones. No, you, you can actually transcribe a scroll into them, make them whatever you want. Oh, I see. So if I like, uh, oh yeah, you're right. Well, it has to be a certain one, doesn't it? it could be any. I think. Well, it might depend on your uh, level of whatever. Well, yeah, obviously. Hail attack, frost generation scroll. Let me see if I can make it make it a random one. I'm actually kind of curious about that. I think he can. Nope, invalid combination. So you're right, it has to be with a scroll. Oh, wait, wait, I think I had one there. Blank air scroll, oh, that's why. Maybe we'll combine those. Bitter, bitter cold, invisible, shocking touch, and blitz bolt. Might as well just fucking combine all these. I don't even care what they are. So what are we doing down here? Uh, I, I don't know. We were looking for the totem, I think. It started with you basically coming down here, and then, then I was like, okay. Invalid combination. Oh, there we go. Blank water skill book. Oh, you're right. Winter blast skill book. Master ability. Is there any good fire abilities I want? Maybe that, uh. Maybe, maybe one of these ones I want to turn into. Ooh, dude. Meteor strike. Totally want to turn that into a fucking. Totally want to turn that into a skill book. Am I glad I told you about this? Yeah. Do I have a. I have a skill book for, uh, let's see. Probably should be doing this before, shouldn't I have? Oh, dude, I need more crafting ability. What the fuck? Do I not have maxed out crafting? Apparently not. Fuck. My crafting ability, is, my crafting gear is not on right now. I guess because I was preparing, uh, Joanne for the... For the fireballs or something, I don't know. Fuck. You don't fucked up, son? No, I was in the last save, I didn't have it. And this is another master ability. It's uh, not ready to buy them. Yeah, I guess not. You just have to have one scroll with it. Bless. Uh, si summon air. Oh, there we go. Magical dart. That sounds pretty good. For some reason, I can pick these barrels up, but I can't loot them. 
blessed. Well, what does blessing allies do? Is blessing any good? Uh, blessing is a chunk to hit, I think. So it's not great. I mean, maybe good for Medora. I could, I could have it as a buff. Might as well. There we go. Bless allies around me. Make invisible. Destroy summon. Wow, this makes it really easy to make books. Like, fucking... Anything I want. That's actually ridiculous. The, the only problem is, I can't use any of this. Actually, wait, how much- how expensive do some of these books become, then? Pretty expensive. That's 300 bucks. Maybe not that expensive. Maybe right. the master level one? I don't know. How many how many more things can I learn for uh, Geomancy? Probably not a whole lot more. Two Adept, so I can have... I already have two Adept abilities. Yeah, fuck this then. Actually, wait, 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 no, 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 not fuck this. Do I, do I use the wolf at all? Maybe I should just get rid of the wolf. I'm gonna get rid of the wolf. Even though, even though I pissed off at you a lot, because I want poison dart. Pissed off at me. I love that. Right, let's try it out on you. Make your blood run black with corruption. Hey, it's pretty effective. I, pr I should probably heal you before you die. No, no, I'm healing you. I swear. <laughs> Fight if. <laughs> Man. You're fine. Abuse the fact that I can't leave the party. That's Who else am I going to do, Don? It's fine, it's like, it's like you were never hit at all. So is there nothing we want down here? Uh, we, there was the diary back in the place before we came here. Yeah. That we didn't read. Yeah, I did, I, that's, I did read it. Oh, you did read it. What did it say? It said that we were supposed to find... That's what it fucking said. It, it gave us a quest. What's the point of coming down here, then? There's no point, then. Fuck, let's leave. I'm gonna pick something up. I'm gonna read my stuff while I wait. So I'll just teleport to you when I'm done. Alright. Yeah, it appears I got nothing. There's someone made in people into demons. There's also more paintings here. Alright, let's try and let's go to the crime scene then. Nice to see a fresh face that ain't green as troll snot. Best make yourself known to Jarl if you haven't yet. Okay, can I just go in here? You again? You got cotton in your ears, or are you just playing stupid? Draw asked me to investigate the matter of the stolen bloodstone. Chief asked you to look into the matter, did he? Well, I can't say if you know your ass from your forehead, but if you've earned Jarl's trust, you've earned mine too. Go ahead and have a look. I fear there won't be much to find, though. All right, let's go find a clue. I found a clue. Okay, I'm getting a raging clue. Apparently, apparently, if we loot that chest, it's a, it's a fucking bad thing. <laughs> I don't even know why it is, though. What's in there? I'm not, I can't, I can't be stealing, Mike. That's not even worth, honestly. But was it? What was in there, even? Just items, like. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna loot. steal fucking gold. I, I'm stealing it all. Fuck you. There. Who gives a fuck? This is, this is not worth the. Also, because I went from Covenant, I don't want to be ever <laughs> anymore. <laughs> there's like, there's literally nothing in here though. Johan's yeah, a dirty thief now. Right. Oh yeah, it is Johan. Uh, I thought it was me. Uh, but you don't see anything in here though. What do you want, Flatlander? If you're here for villages, we've shipped them all out already. You Loud and bloody well clear, sir. What's going on here? I'm overheating. How are things progressing? Any of them spilled the gruel? <laughs> Let's just say the prisoners kept here. Hey, heard you showed them what for downstairs. Is that right? A fellow of the mountain, indeed. If not by blood. All right. Oh. Well. May your sword never sully. And your shield never shatter. Discuss the missing bloodstones. The bloodstones are the reason we came here. Uh, we already know about this. That is why I ask of you to find proof. Uh, proof that it was a. Well, 
We don't have our proof yet. I, I could still maybe talk to some other guys. They're just telling me to make myself known to the Yarl. I wonder if this guy's like knows if he's guarding like literally nothing. Yeah, okay, there's nothing these guys have for me anymore. Is there anywhere, anywhere we haven't been yet? Here? I don't think so. I think I've been everywhere. I don't know. I don't, well, we'll look into it, guys, and I guess uh, I guess that's all the time we got for today, guys. Next time we'll uh, we'll have a look around here. We can go near the fountain here. Actually, yeah, we'll go find because well, actually there was that one guy who was like so like because he said like he ran off with bloodstones. Maybe we can find him. He ran off with bloodstones. Like the orc said, like uh, the guy who was on guard was seen running away with the bloodstones. Yeah, I have no idea where he is though. Just, everyone thinks he was lying though. Is the thing. All right, well, well, we'll do that next time, guys. Take care. Bye. Bye.